Hello all and welcome back to Kirby 64. Today we're going to be doing the extra stuff down the options menu, even though it's more than options, so I don't know why it's called the options extra, maybe like the extra menu, but whatever, they can call it options. So we got mini games, enemy info, the theater, and check that out right now. You basically just waddle D and then you basically just watch anything. There you go, see Adeline. Acting Adeline, not Tracy. And then you basically just watch all the things again, and that's basically it. Pretty simple. There's a sound check, which you know, there's 631 sound effects. That's fantastic. And okay, 62 musics. Let's do 14. Ooh, fancy. So yeah, you can do sound effects, listen to all that. That's very standard. I. I actually don't think you have to beat the game to unlock this. You get it for like doing it. Maybe you beat the game. Maybe I don't know. Something. You'll do something to get this, but it's not unlocked at first, but then you'll get it. It's pretty simple. There's box battles. There's settings. Not many settings. This is the five displays you can have there. We're not going to even look at those, but let's look at the enemy info real quick. And you see, there's nine pages. I did not get very many of them. But basically, what it does. You just click on it, shows a picture of them, their name, and their type, or their type, their ability if you have it, that's bomb, Rocky, Bronto Bird, he's a classic, it's good. These are called Slushy, that's kind of cute. Mahal, I don't know what they're going for with that one. Gabon, isn't that a place that, they had Survivor in Gabon, this is where Survivor and Gabon took place, it took place on this guy. No it didn't. Sandman, that's disturbing. New? Maybe it's no. I don't know. This guy's called Sawyer. He's from Lost. This is what he looked like before he went on the island. It's a ghost knight. That's kind of cool, actually. I like him more. This guy is a zoo. It's multiple zoos in one. They actually have animals inside of him. That's why he's electric. Because he's powered up to keep the animals fed. This guy's rocking. Fucking terrible. I'm not even gonna read that guy's name. Sparky, he's a classic. Ignis, that's just a rock. I don't know why it's called Ignis. That's that's a rock. Patera, and of course they got the, the yeah Zeppelin, and that's it. There's a lot of enemy cards here. I'm not gonna grind them out for them. That's annoying. What I'm gonna do is play all the mini games though. We got three of them. 100 yard hop. Bumper crop bump and my favorite checkboard chase, but let's let's start with bumper card 100. Yeah. Anyway, you can pick up any of the four characters. Let's start with Kirby because he's Kirby. There's easy, normal, hard, and very intense. I think it's intense. But anyway, you can either hop one space or hop two spaces, and let's just get to it. Basically, you're racing to hop, and yeah, that's basically it. And I messed up. It's okay if you mess up on the first one because it's the first level. It's supposed to be easy. But yeah. And I messed up again. I'm supposed to be good at this, but I guess not today. You're gonna have to be good on the later levels because it gets it gets well it gets intense. Also don't touch the frogs, the frogs are bad too. And I keep doing that, but like I said, the enemies are enemies. Your opponents, they're not your enemies, they're your friends. There's actually another Kirby there. But that's easy. Once you beat one mode, you get the next mode. So easy unlocks hard, or easy unlocks, easy unlocks hard. Easy unlocks normal, normal unlocks hard, hard unlocks that. I'm just going to do it until I can't do it anymore. Because, yeah, there's that. But yeah, we got first. Got the best score, obviously. Can we just play again? Oh, no. Okay. I guess let's play another game. And no, I don't want to be Kirby. I want to let's be DDD this time. And there we go. Let's do normal. And now we got banana peels. Oh my god. Not banana peels. That's terrible. I can't deal with banana peels. That's that's too much for me. And I messed up. I mean you can still mess up on normal. It's not 
that bad. Once you get to like intense, if you mess up, that's that's it. You're done. Because those people are intense, are impossible. I guess they're intense, you know? And hence the name, ha, huh? what a shock. Well, that was really easy. I, I did that faster than no easy mode. Sometimes you just get lucky. Let's look at these fools. There's three DDDs. I guess that makes sense, given his name. You know, I'm D, that's third player's D, fourth player's D, and then you got not Tracy's four. They all, wow, third and fourth. No, they didn't tie. I thought they tied for a second there. They did not tie. But that's simple enough. Let's go do hard. Let's, let's be not Tracy this time. Do some hard. Let's see how this goes. Probably not well. I'm probably going to fail this one. As you can see, they're failing too. Don't step on those. Just keep avoiding everything that looks like a trap because it probably is. If it's not a circle, it's not good. That's basically the rule. Follow the, oh, whoops. Follow the circles. Okay, so this is terrible. Alright, that was kind of <laughs> annoying, but we got through it. Those are probably like pitfalls. I don't even know what they are. Just don't jump on them. Watch out for the frog. And there we go. Simple enough. You can watch as these losers come on. I guess I'm not Tracy and that's Adeline. No, I'm just kidding. It doesn't matter. They're all the same person. That was really easy though. But let's see how much intense will be. Let's do Waddle D. Oh look, I'm the only Waddle D for a while. Intense has an exclamation point. That's how you know it's intense. You know it's crazy now with an exclamation point. Anyway, now we got fishes. Random fishes now. What is happening? You got the shells. Don't step on the shells. You actually can step on the shells. I think you might actually have to step on the shells at some point. So it's good to know. And what the hell just happened there? I don't know. Just don't step on anything that's not a rock. And this is kind of scary. I don't know how I'm doing so well like that. You gotta do it, but... Oh my god. Oh my god, that was awful. I actually didn't do that bad. I just messed up at the end there. I'm not gonna do that again. That was intense. You saw it. I could have won. Let's go to uh, Bumper Crop Bump. And this is probably my least favorite of them. You basically just bump and move. Try and catch the most. It's... Yeah, it's it's this. This is what it is. This looks like a Mario Party minigame. Just push everything out of the way. Bump them if you want it. Like I said, this could probably be a Mario Party minigame, but... This isn't Mario Party. This is Kirby. I don't really like this game. It also takes a long time. Wow, jerk. I mean, I guess there's some strategy involved, but... It's more like push each other out of the way and get really annoying. I'll keep missed it too. And what the hell? Why am I going that way? Woo! So this is the game. It's, yeah. It's not really even interesting. It's just, yeah. I like that they put the detail that I have stuff sticking out of my basket because I have a lot. That's, that's cool, I guess. Well, poor Waddle D doesn't have anything. Well, sucks to be him. But yeah, this is, yeah. There's nothing to say about this. It's just, you put stuff in a basket and you do it. And wow. Yeah. So how about those mini games, huh? Pretty cool, right? Kirby just bouncing around. Oh, and here comes the end. Everything falls at once. It's it's pretty much that. Yeah. Like I said, this could be a Mario Party mini game, but this is not Mario Party. It's probably Half better than half the Mario Party's out there today now, and I completely dominate everybody. This guy just threw me into one. I literally over doubled the second place person. I don't even want to play higher difficulties. That game's boring, so let's play the better game, which is this one, which is Checkerboard Chase. And basically, you're on a checkerboard and you basically shoot blocks, they fall down, and your goal is to knock everyone else down. And it's awesome. I love this game. You knock everyone else down, you avoid getting down. There's a lot of strategy to it if you want to do it, or you can just spam it and hope it falls down. That's also something you can do. I love this game. And it's also really hard on harder difficulties, as expected, because the computers uh, cheat. 
because, yeah, they're computers. They cheat. That's what they do. These people on easy don't cheat. They feel, feel like I'm cheating because they're kind of that easy to beat. Uh, once you somebody uh, loses all their life, the edges go down and it goes down twice, obviously, for the other person. So the machine gets smaller, so then, you know, you don't have as much room for two people to run around. Oh, I finally lost my first one. What? I was just... Oh, because I had the thing, that's why. And there we go. Wow. That was a joke. But that is that. It's pretty good. We're going to play more of the other one. Let's be not Tracy this time. Oh, there's a lot of not Tracy's. I see the board changes color. That's kind of cool. Uh, run out of the way. This gets pretty intense, as I said, on harder difficulties. It gets, you could say, it gets intense on intense mode. I, you could say that I wouldn't, because that's a terrible pun. But you could say that as we just get rid of all these clones. Yeah, we don't want the clones. I'm the real one. I wish you could actually be a different color as player one, but you can't be. It's only for the other players. What is happening here? I'm glad that didn't work out for not Tracy. I almost hit him. Oh, there goes player three. Well, this is this game. I like it a lot. This is always fun. If you actually have friends you can play with, then you can do that and then be kind of crazy. You got four people running around all trying to kill each other. That's always fun. I'm... Okay. Oh my god. And... The computers are still pretty easy on normal, obviously. But yeah, there's that. Let's move up to hard mode, see what we got there. How hard could it possibly be? Right? Pretty, pretty hard. Well, not that hard, I'm already winning, technically. Oh, well, there it goes. Player 3 is winning now. Oh god. Help. No! Well, that didn't go so well. Now I'm losing. Did that thing just spawn me over a pit? I mean, I know I have the... Oh my god. This is brutal. They're just going after me. I don't even think they're trying to go after me. They just end up going after me. And I lost. I came in last place. That was terrible. Yeah, that was pretty terrible. I guess you just watch how they're going. Uh, so while D is not not good, basically, is what's happening. And they just lost it. If both people fall at the same time and it's the last life, uh, it technically awards it to a winner. I think it awards it to whoever technically dropped last. Because one person has to drop first, because one person has to shoot the thing first. So technically, someone does win. So it's not a draw. There is no draw in this game. Somebody wins. I did terrible. We'll give that one more shot as Kirby. And if I lose this time, well then, that's it. We're moving away from this. But let's just see how it goes. I also wish you could pick your pick the computer so you know. Oh, well, I'm off to a great start. You know, maybe just focus on one person. One thing you can do is, you know, if you try and be smart, you know, like blocks them in, but then that happens and then you lose. So, you know, you kind of got to pay attention to everything. That's what makes this hard. I don't think I've hit one person. Another thing you do is just kind of su survive, you know, let the computers take themselves out. That's something you could do. It's not going very well, but it's something you can do. There goes player four finally. You know, like bam, hit him. And now I'm just kinda screwed. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh my goodness. Where am I stuck? I'm like stuck on the corner. Well I got one health to try and take off player four who has, you know, four. So I think I'm gonna win. You know, just Yeah. Definitely. I think we just gang up on player four, right player two? Well, I lost. So this didn't go very well. But, you know, not Tracy just kicked everyone's ass. So that's helping. And there you go. 
Of course the painter wins on a move where you paint blocks. What a shock. But that's all for those mini games. Let's do the last thing that's left and let's do boss battles because every Kirby game has boss battles. It's what you expect. That's a kind of weird picture. Look at that. You got all the bosses here. Zero two. That's a shark but it's supposed to be acro. I don't know. So you guys go through every single stage boss. Starting with Wispy Woods. I'll get this one shot. I'm probably not going to win. As such, you don't have power-ups like always. That was terrible. You don't get health. You basically just gotta fight every single boss with no power-ups. But one after another with no health. It's hard. Like anything in Kirby game. Every single boss been on Kirby game, it's hard. But yeah. This is what it is, I'll give it a shot. I should have saved the apple. I thought he was gonna do the apples first. He did not. What to do. Basically, the strategy remains the same for all of them. You just shoot, go. Make Kirby jump around like a madman. Get multiple apples. I don't picture myself going very far on this. Especially Acro. Acro, the whale. The killer whale, who looks like a shark in that diagram. Whatever they are, that thing's a pain with no power-up. I just swallowed the apple. Ugh, take this. Ugh. So this is, Wispy Woods kick my ass right now. I've already gotten hurt on him. So, you know, that goes to show how bad this is. It's also taking forever. It's Wispy Woods, he should be dead three times by now. One thing that's pretty sad about this is, unlike all the other games where you just attack Wispy Woods' face directly, you don't even get to hit him. He's, you know, he's taking advantage of the 3D. You know, you just attack his roots. You don't attack his face. That's really sad. But, it's still a fun game. Did I finally do it? There we go. We finally beat Wispy Woods. We can move on to Pix. This guy. And yes, you have to first spend the first part of this boss just avoiding everything. It's still the same. Yeah, there's not much to say here. We've already seen this. This is just boss battles. It's like every Kirby game. It doesn't change. There's no mini bosses, I guess that's something. Some of them have mini bosses, not this one. Because the mini bosses are just big enemies, then you know there's nothing really special about them. I can't believe I hit almost with woods, that's just stupid. So I like how the camera's kind of zooming out, you know, as you get more like when it was just the red one, it was kind of zoomed in. And then you got green, it zoomed out. Now it's really zoomed out. They probably do that because it's, you know, it's harder to see all three of them. So zoomed in. But, you know. Yeah. Now yeah, I can finally attack him. It's been like it's been like 20 minutes. Now we can finally attack the boss. As they do this stupid one. Well, I'm beating the green one up. I guess that's good. I should not have gotten hit there. That's entirely my, oh my god. So I don't think I'm gonna win this one. You know, just, how did I kill that thing before the green one? Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna win this one. Just, just, yeah. I can't even hit him. That's, that's half the problem. Wow. I'm not even trying at this point. <laughs> well, he's almost dead. Stop going the right way, and there we go. I beat him. Now we, <laughs> now we have to beat the stupid whale with no power up and two pieces of health. 
I'm gonna die really quickly. How bad could this possibly be? You just shot a gourd at me. Why do you have gourds in your mouth? Why do you have skulls in your stomach, for that matter? What are you doing? What are you doing? Stop doing it. What are you doing? That was stupid. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Whatever. I could get Cutter. If I don't- Oh my god. I hate you, Acro. I really hate you. Like, with, with the passion. It's more like half a passion. It's not much of a passion, but, you know, like, once, once, we, once we leave, we're not, you know, like, friends anymore, but I don't hate you. But at this moment, I really hate you. Oh my god. I want to, like, Kirby's giving you the finger right now, but he doesn't have fingers, so he's just kind of, like, swimming, but he's actually giving you the finger. Kind of shouldn't swim so close to him, because if he shoots out of Gordo, you know you're screwed. But I hate you. And I have one health left to finish the rest of the boss battles. <laughs> yeah, right. Okay. Well, there's his other move. He does that. I know I killed him way too fast. What's he doing? Oh my god. Stop, Acro. And well, that was my boss battles run. It. I think it went pretty well. It's hopeless. That's the darkest thing I've seen from a Kirby game ever. This right here. I'm just contemplating this, like, this is dark. Like, this is what, this is what people feel in life. This is how they feel. It's hopeless. I'm just going to leave it on this as I do the entrance because it's hopeless. You know, that's, yeah, it's hopeless. But I had fun doing this <laughs> on a brighter note. I really enjoyed doing Kirby 64. It was a nice small little game to do for a nice welcome back after I disappeared forever after Tony Hawk's on the ground, but hopefully it doesn't happen again. You know, I'm planning on doing more things. My cat is underneath my shelf. I don't know what she's doing right now. She's licking herself. That's that's hopeless. But yeah. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed Kirby 64. I hope you enjoyed it as well. Whatever was going on. What the hell is this? Why is there an earring in my room? Whatever. There's that. That's all I have. That's all the extras. It's not a big game. It's an N64 game. Yeah. So, until the next game, which, whatever that is, I don't, he haven't even decided what I'm doing next, but until then, it's hopeless. And see you later.